welcome to Steelworks and Brewing. I'm Randy. Uh, this is a channel that's all about home distillation and brewing. Uh, today we're going to make a single malt American whiskey. So let's get started. Uh, so first thing we're going to do is we're going to have to mash in some grains. Uh, I've already added in here about three gallons of 160 degree water I'm aiming for 155 once I put in the uh, in the grain so you got to go in slowly uh, we're going to try to avoid uh, dough balls when we're done it should look a lot like uh, oatmeal Make sure you uh, you star sand on everything to uh, sanitize. Make sure it's all nice and mixed up. So everything is mixed up. Now we're going to. Uh, take the temperature Temperature is very important And I am running right at a hundred and fifty five so that's perfect Okay so we're going to let that sit in there for a minute and we're going to, what we're doing is mashing in we're going to convert all the uh, starches that is in that grain into sugars and that's what we need so that's going to sit in there for about, a, about an hour we'll use an iodine test to make sure that we did the conversions. Okay, uh, we're gonna do a little iodine test here. Take a little sample of the uh, liquid in that. And this is just iodine you get uh, at the grocery store where we need a little drop in there. And if you notice, I'll bring this over so you can see. You notice uh, the how that turned black. Okay. So what that means is that we have plenty of starch. All right. The iodine will um, indicate there's starch in that liquid. So what we're going to do, we're going to let this sit for about an hour. We'll come back and do another iodine test to make sure that the conversion took place. Okay, we'll be back. Okay, so we sparged out the uh, grains. We'll take a little, uh, use a refractometer here, take a uh, 1.095. Now we did add two pounds of uh, table sugar to get to boost up a little bit. Okay, so what we'll need to do is let this cool down to uh, fermenting temperatures, uh, right around 70, 75 degrees. And then we'll introduce yeast, and we'll wait for about another week to 10 days, and when she's done fermenting, 
and we'll move on to uh, we'll distill this out and thank you for watching enjoy the adventure okay just a quick recap of what we did we first we sanitized everything then we heated up some water to about 160 degrees we uh, put three gallons into the mash tun we put our 13 pounds of grain in and then we let the uh, let that steep in there mash in for about an hour maybe just an hour and ten minutes and then we did a iodine test it uh, converted to the the uh, the grains over or the uh, starches from the grains into sugars then what we did was we uh, sparged all the liquid into a fermenter uh, and then what we're going to do is let that come down to pitching yeast for the yeast yeast pitching temperature excuse me to right around 75 degrees all right and then we'll add yeast we're going to let it sit there for a week to 10 days when it's done fermenting then we'll move on to the next step. It's been about 12 hours. This is the uh, single malt American whiskey mash or varsh. Fermentation is well on its way. <laughs> 